Hey everyone, and thanks for joining me here on Altcoin Radar. Today, guys, I'm going to give you guys my honest long term prediction for Zillica or ZIL. And if you guys like the content, then make sure to subscribe to my channel and give the video a thumbs up. And also, guys, follow me on Twitter with the link in the video description below. I'm going to be doing um, some giveaways in the in the near future. So if you want to take uh, take part in those, then uh, just follow the link in the video description and uh, or sorry, follow me on my Twitter profile file in the link description. And there you go. It's as simple as that. All right. So, um, you know, for those of you who aren't or who are new to my channel and haven't seen my pri any of my price prediction videos, um, I do not use TA. Reason why I'm not a short term trader. I don't do any short term trading. I don't care about um, where the coin's going to be two months from now. I don't care where the coin's going to be tomorrow. Um, I care where the coin is going to be five plus years from now. I could care less about uh, two months from now, whatever. Um, I do follow the coins that I love. I do follow uh, their, you know, their developments and the things they've got going on. But um, I'm more interested in how high the coin can go in the future, the long-term future. So that's why I do this. Um, so yeah, today I'm going to do a little bit of research and I'm going to do some math and I'm going to see, you know, where potentially Zillica could be in relation to uh, market caps of, you know, where the market caps are right now and where they could be five plus years from now. All right, so Zillica, Z-I-L, love this coin, love this project. All right, so guys, uh, let's see here. We're going to take, okay, so the current circulating supply is 11.44 billion. Now in in five plus years, that's probably going to be closer, more closer to their max supply, which I mean, their max supply is 21 billion. Um, so in five years, it very well could be close to 21 billion. In five years, it probably could be like, you know, um, for this price prediction video, I'm probably gonna go with, I mean, I'm probably going to go with about 18 billion for this one. Um, so we'll take 18 billion. Uh, come on, 18 billion, and we are going to multiply it by. Uh, let's see here. First of all, what is the what is what's the all-time high for Zilka? I don't even remember. So the all-time high is 25 cents. So guys, we're going to see if it can get to one dollar. So I, oh, whoops, dang calculator. All right, multiply by 1.00. Obviously, that's going to be 18 billion. That's going to be an 18 billion dollar market cap. Which, guys, when you think about this, 18 billion dollar market cap is super small. I mean, look at where Polkadot is right now at number nine at 14 billion. Um, you know, it it could go a lot higher than that. In my personal opinion, it really could. I mean, we're talking five plus years from now. We're not talking a year from now. Five plus years from now, Bitcoin could be at you know. 10 trillion dollar market cap you just never know i mean it hit 1 trillion dollar market cap just recently um so it could very well it bitcoin could very well be well over you know well probably not 10 trillion but it could be well over you know 5 trillion dollar market cap at, by then and if it is that means all these other coins are going to go straight up as far as market cap as well you know people are going to be buying into these so especially projects like zillica so, you know, $18 billion market cap, I, I really feel like that, you know, that's definitely a possibility. Um, now, if we were to double that, so if it went to $2, you know, I mean, not to, not to be a little, not to shill the coin or anything like that, but I mean, guys, $2, that's only, <laughs> $2 is only a $36 billion market cap. And again, that's still, in my opinion, that's still pretty low. And that's where Dogecoin is sitting right now. And I mean, what does Dogecoin do? I mean, really? Um, so yeah, I mean, honestly, I, I think realistically, I think this coin could potentially go to at least $2 minimum in five plus years as a very long term investment. Um, you know, whether you guys believe me or not, or whether, whether you guys, uh, um, whether you guys, uh, you know, believe what I have to say or not, you know, hey, the math is right there. It doesn't lie. The numbers don't lie. Um, you know, it is what it is. Uh, there's, but there's a big difference between people who are trading, you know, monthly or swing trading. And there's a huge difference between those guys and the people like me who like to hold for years on end. I mean, I'm holding coins that I've been holding on to for five plus years. I haven't sold in any of the bull markets and I don't plan to because I don't want those profits. I want bigger profits. So I, I don't really care. Um, you know, you just got to hold, 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 hold for the long term. So that's what I'm doing. 
Um, so yeah, guys, uh, that pretty much does it for this video, though. So I guess it's you know, time for me to go ahead and wrap things up. But uh, again, guys, before you leave, you know, don't forget to follow me on Twitter with the link in the video description, please. And go ahead and take a minute to subscribe to my channel so that you never miss a new crypto and altcoin video from me. And with that said, you guys, thanks again for watching, and I hope to see you guys in the comment section of my future videos.